Hello everyone, this is Meads and this is going to be an unboxing video for number 279, BB Senshi Onimitsu Ninja no Maru. And here's a box art. And one thing I really like about this kit is the amount of gold it has and as well as that um, color difference between the left and right side. Kind of reminds me of Kamen Rider. So you have the white on the right side and black on the left side and it's drawing a big shuriken <laughs> so here's that bottom part again this is 279 the ninth one they released and here's the side box art um, as you can see they have um, chrome plated parts which is pretty awesome and uh, I guess they have this you know way back when I guess chrome plating is cheaper than what it is now here we go and I guess you can use um, this another kit to combine the armor which is kinda cool and um, for those um, Sangokidens or Sangokidens um, you probably notice this is quite similar to the number 350 Date Masamune Gundam which I think they just use the same uh, mold but they just changed the accessories yep and this retails for 600 yen and why don't we open this thing so uh, before we open actually I just noticed that there's some um, box art at the back which is um, you hardly see that and just more poses of the Onimitsu Ninja no Maru and um, more comics and I guess this is pretty much um, where it connects the normal Super Deform to the Chibi ones. So as you can see, I have all those three down there. And apparently there's this guy here, which can be combined to the armor of the normal Super Deform. Which is kind of interesting. Hmm. <laughs> and yeah, why don't we open this? And again, there's more um, several Super Deformed kits on the side, which are quite old, like number 47 and number 38. And now I know which I have, I think. <laughs> and more stuff on this side, which I can't read. <laughs> Anyways, inside, um, oh, we have an open palm there the two sides of the helmet the forehead feet shoulders and front plate armor and there's this um peace sign it's pretty cool oh if you haven't noticed there's a gash in the middle of the palm which is i'm wondering why is that is that there on purpose <laughs> and there you go Next one. So I guess this is a weapon. And um looks like a barrel. And um I guess this is a part of the shuriken. Um this might be a shoulder armor. Hmm, interesting. So I'm wondering if the that that must have used the same design or molds as the weapons. And here's the sort of black or grayish, uh, it, it is a glossy black um, runner. So, torso. Um, I guess this somewhat like the gun. And I guess shoulder armor, maybe. And you do have the sword and some chains. And I guess this is a feet or a leg. Polycaps uh, does come with quite a lot, so good articulation. And this one, this is pretty much um, why you want to get this kit. Chrome plated parts. And it's really shiny, and as you can see, there's a like a lion there, which is pretty cool. Or and it's two sided, which you can combine. 
so it's only gold on this front part but it's just regular kind of matte silver in the back stickers so we have one set of eyes a um, couple of ninja themed like this one for the arms yep and uh, I'm not sure if this is the bandana or oh we'll see oh there's a cool looking dragon <laughs> Or like a mask. And there's a yin and yang sign. So that's for the stickers. Now we're gonna go with the illustrated booklet. Which I always find interesting. Okay, so as you can see, um, I guess you can use this um, super deform and put the armor on him. And you can also use the long blade of uh, red sumaru, which I have. And we shall probably gonna try. <laughs> And um, the helmet looks like the one for, um, I think it was Ranmaru, so I might give that a try as well. And more poses. Hmm. <laughs> and let's see inside, so this is the comics, which I'll probably go over later. Um, instruction, quite a lot. <laughs> wow. Which is pretty cool. Um, I guess there's a lot of things I can do with this. This is a shuriken assembly. And I guess this is the one for that um, other armor. Which I kind of want to get. I either can choose from the black or the gold one. And here's the comics, which I guess starts here. <laughs> and I can't read it, but I can. I guess he's getting sh shaken up. <laughs> and there goes the bad guys. Not even sure if I'm going through the panels correctly, but. Well, he transformed, and. Well, it seems like they're just fighting. There you go. And let's see. So more illustration. And um and this is the the pretty much the weapon, transformation, and I do recognize that to the Date uh, Date Masamune's um uh pictures, so I guess it has similar. <laughs> yep. And there you go, um, I'll be building this kit, and um, as you can see, this thing is gold plated. So, it comes in yellow, so I might have to paint that gold. Yep. But um, I still have to check us. There's, there are, I'm using acrylic plate, it kind of scrape off to the, you know, joints. So, we'll see how that goes. And there you go. Again, this is Means, thank you for watching.